got all the answers. A maths lesson at Harrogate Primary School in Stockton on Tees. The Here they do a lot of mental arithmetic, quick fire calculations, and work on their times tables. And I want you to find the teachers the spend much of the time addressing the whole class all together Six, from the front. From the it's a method key. they introduced a year ago well after done. the old well method were failing to get results. It moves away from the group teaching methods. Children are very actively learning as opposed to passively learning. I feel that children are actually encouraged to increase their speed and their accuracy of their mental calculations. Right. But most schools don't teach this way. As a result, British pupils lag behind again. children in countries like so Hungary moment, and Switzerland where mental arithmetic is a higher priority. So the Numeracy Task Force recommends a daily maths lesson of between 45 minutes and an hour with pupils doing regular mental arithmetic and teachers spending more time teaching the whole class together rather than supervising group or individual work. We want to see a great deal more emphasis on effective whole class teaching where the children themselves are actually part of the process, love doing it, join in with it, based obviously on getting their mental arithmetic skills up to scratch, ensuring that in the use of tables we encourage the use of memory and equipping youngsters for a 21st century where we, they will have to use these skills in the computer age. The government's experts also want less reliance on calculators in primary schools, although they don't suggest banning them. They should be used sparingly, um, ages, well, probably, probably scarcely there at all, five to seven, sparingly seven to nine, that their use would be tapered coming in towards the end of the primary school experience and that they should not replace children's mental understanding and arithmetic. And as if to prove the point, one education minister being interviewed on this subject found himself briefly forgetting his tables. Finally, Mr Byers, what are eight sevens? Eight sevens, I'm worried, I was worried you were going to ask me this. I think it's 54, but... Uh, uh, no, I think it's 56, actually 56. 56. Well, there you are. It shows, uh, it shows my age, I'm afraid. These changes have been dubbed a return to traditional teaching, but the government's experts say that's an oversimplification. What they want is more whole-class teaching with pupils actively involved in mental arithmetic rather than simple passive rote learning. Mike Baker, BBC News, at the Department for Education. The Equal Opportunities Commission has attacked the current law. Like a llama, he has cloven hooves. His owners hope he'll have more wool than a camel and a better temperament. Foreign Secretary has